hanbok or Korean traditional clothing is now regarded as something that belongs in the world of high fashion. Thanks in no small parts to designer Yi Young Hee. Our Kim Ji Young got a chance to sit down for a one on one with the woman regarded as a pioneer of modern hanbok. It'd be difficult not to be captivated by the color and lines of the full high skirt or the long sleeve top called chogori, which make up the traditional Korean dress or hanbok. They're part of a collection by famed hanbok designer Lee Young-hee that goes on display this Wednesday at the Dongdaewon Design Plaza in Seoul. Lee Young-hee is known as a pioneer of modern hanbok design, incorporating an off-the-rack concept rather than the usual custom fit process. Her innovations to Korea's traditional dress have brought her fame. And it's because of her beautiful designs that she's been named one of the world's top 60 artists in the Google Artist campaign since 2008. But her rise to fame wasn't without hurdles. When Yi first presented her collection overseas in Paris in 1993, many mistakenly referred to her dresses as Japanese kimonos. The shock of this prompted Lee to take on the role of an ambassador of sorts when it came to introducing the hanbok to the international stage of high fashion. I had this calling that I should let the world see for itself the beauty of hanboks, of Korean tradition, and it paid off. Even in the eyes of Westerners, the hanbok was so beautiful. They were captivated by the movement of the rippling skirt, its colorful hues, and the embroidery. Her designs gained widespread attention in 2010 after they graced the runway of a haute couture in Paris, drawing top fashion names like Dior, Armani and Prada. Yi, who touts a 40-year-long career, says her goal now is to present her collections during the haute couture week every year. I have so many ideas because the development of the hanbok is endless. I want to tell my successors that our traditional culture opens us up to so many possibilities and inspirations. Traditional patchworks and embroidery pointed out as items that continuously inspire Yi are also at display at the exhibition which runs until October 9th. Kim Jian, Arirang News.